Recently, MIT researchers have come up with an inexpensive way to create solar cells from agricultural waste. It is meant for the countries that do not have the proper infrastructure for electricity. It is a very simple idea. It's a, it's a little bit like agriculture. You can grow it and then you can grow your own food, cook it and consume it. The same way we want to now be able to grow, uh, con cook and consume solar power. The material used to make the solar cell is all agricultural waste or coming from dumps. The raw material essentially has negative cost. This means that there are no harmful chemicals to pollute the environment. Pretty much everything that goes into making that cell, uh, you can eat. <laughs> it won't taste good, but you won't, it won't hurt you. The object of MIT's research was to make the process of optimizing this technology easier to access. Labs in your high school, which I'm sure you have some, uh, are now capable of taking these kind of things that we've created, making your own version of this, and trying different combinations of materials in your own lab with your teachers, because we've made everything so easy that you, don't, you no longer require lasers and high vacuums and molecular beam epitaxy machines, uh, such that we are crowdsourcing the optimization. When this technology reaches its full potential, it will be a revolutionary step forward for developing countries. If you have a light bulb at night, you can study at night and educate yourself instead of going to sleep. The scientists of tomorrow will get started today.